the ability to keep our data and technology systems safe and performing to high standards. In a brutally simple way, in our rapidly digitizing world, nothing else can be accomplished if we can't get that one activity right. And that, unsurprisingly, is a people challenge. We need to have enough creative, motivated, skilled people to take on a variety and volume of threat vectors to our information security that increases every single day. Given the importance of this challenge and the fact that information security lies at the heart of every other important challenge of our time, from national security, rebuilding our infrastructure, economic productivity, climate resilience, whatever it is, uh, information security is vital to accomplishing our most important objectives as a society. It's also fair to ask how well we're doing at producing the talent we need to accomplish those important objectives. Short answer is not all that well. We've all seen the headlines for the cyber talent gap, depending on who you should talk to, between 500,000 and 700,000 unfilled jobs exist in the cyber sector right now. That's just in the US alone. Across the globe, there are millions more. On an annualized basis, in the United States alone, the university system, boot camps, and every part of the training enterprise produces about 200,000 uh, IT credentials uh, and certificates a year, of which cyber makes up only about 40,000. So on a steady state basis, this is a problem we won't solve for a decade, even if there isn't a single person who leaves the field. Uh, and that's not the case. Attrition due to stress and retirement is going up, not down. And we are not expanding sources of supply fast enough. And this isn't just a problem for the tech sector. Information security affects every operating enterprise, every government entity in the entire economy.